Hey everyone! In this video, I'll show you exactly how to display or hide content on your website in a specific language. Let's get started! The first thing you need to do is to create two different elements in your original website. One element for your original language and the second one for the language you want to translate it into. These elements will be present in the original version, but they will never display at the same time because of some custom code we'll be putting in. The second step is to add a specific CSS selector. This can be a class or ID for each element you're setting up. A CSS selector is used to locate or choose the elements you want to modify. We'll be using it to hide content in this instance. To find the CSS selector, you will either find a dedicated field or add the class or ID yourself directly into the HTML, which will look like this. Going back to our example, you can assign English dash button for the icon linked to the English URL and French dash button for the icon linked to the French URL. Once you're done with that, the third step is to head on over to your Weglot dashboard. Click on settings, then go to the language switcher. Put the following code into the custom CSS field as shown here. Take a look at this part. In this example, this property instructs your website to hide that particular element when the language is not French. Be sure to replace the language codes EN and FR in the example with the actual languages you're using. If you aren't sure what the language code of your original language is, head on over to your source code. To access your source code, go to your website homepage. Right-click anywhere on the page, then select View Page Source for Google Chrome and Firefox or Show Page Source for Safari. It will display at the top and look like this. If your website's original language is in English with an EN-US shortcode, the code you'll use will look like this. Then, if you want to apply the code for a third language like Spanish, all you have to do is add one more line of custom CSS. It will look like this. And that's it! Now you know how to display or hide content in a specific language. Be sure to check out our other tutorials to learn how to make the most of your multilingual website. Of course, don't hesitate to reach out to support at weglot.com if you need more assistance. See you next time!